this is uh, Dennis here from Safe Slot, and I'm playing Kerbal Space Program, which is currently my favorite game ever. Uh, anyway, um, I've made a pretty cool ship here. I call it the Discoverer, because it looks like the Discovery from 2001. Well, it has the head anyway. Um, he's going to have our mods, um, as you can see. I can't remember the name of it, but I'll, I'll try and I'll put some linkies in here. Um, either way, oh my god, the rockets are stuck in the ground. Yeah, look at that. It's, it does, it's so massive, it doesn't even need landing support. Look at that, that's a nice takeoff. Go, rocket. Look at that. It's incredible. And that rotating centrifuge is pretty cool. That's like an experimental mod. It doesn't... It's not 100% awesome, but it's... It, it, well, it is 200% awesome. Anyway, we'll just fast forward a bit here. It looks kind of like a man. Sort of like a human being, man. Look at it go. Little man dancing in the sky. Dancey dance, dancey man. Ah, oh, his legs fell off. Huh. The rocket is now powered by his massive dong. Dong powered rocket. <coughs> to the sky. Look at this dong thrust. Dong thrust. That should be. I'm trademarking that. Look at the power of dong. Uh oh, no, 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 you gotta put your, no, 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 go back the other way, oh shit, this dong is not powerful enough, uh oh, oh boy, back to the drawing board, well, the solution in Kerbal is pretty much more struts, more rockets, more struts, more rockets, works every time pretty much, you just put more everything, just make it beefier, beef it up, <coughs> and then, uh, Put some little boosters on the side here. I love the boosters. Yeah, so still haven't really got rid of that wobble, but you know, it's probably probably not something that needs to be. Look, okay, I, don't know. I, I see your point. Shit. Oh my god. I'll look on the bright side. The view. It's breathtaking. Oh god. Oh god. Well, at least now we know where the break was. The struts did a lot of good, clearly. Well, perseverance, that is like the main element in space travel, is continuous perseverance. I suppose, well, NASA would probably disagree with me and say mission planning would go a lot more, but in this video game, well, until they, really, I, I guess this is uh, the last... Uh, bit that I'm going to be playing in the in the 2.0 or the alpha stage and then they've got this like 2.1 update coming out soon and it's going to involve uh, career mode which has like you know different astronauts um, you can train and shit and like they have stats and stuff so you're like you got you gotta like not kill them which you know it's an acquired skill I've been trying to like retool my gameplay so that I'm like thinking about bringing people home and stuff, whereas, you know, as I've been playing this game, I just kind of drop on planets. Oh, anyway, that, that, that kind of got fucked up, but it looks like I might be able to fix it. I mean, it's kind of back on track. Okay. Yeah, yeah. That was truly an Apollo 13 moment. Yeah, I don't know about that. I don't think there's going to be enough fuel to get into orbit, so, yeah, you're all going to die. Look at them, they look so scared. Kinda of right there, it's just these eyes are bolting under his skull. Yeah, so there's not enough fuel, and we're going to plummet back to the surface. But that's okay. You know, just try try again. But look at these pretty shots we're able to get before we smash turtling into the earth. Isn't that nice? I mean it does not look like something that should be in space. Like why don't we have that in real life? Ah. Look at that. Nice, solid booster separation. So those boosters really help me get into orbit here. Which is, you know, good. Because not orbit is not good. Woo. Flashy. And... Orbit! Yay! We're not gonna die. Yet. Pretty. It's just 
Just look at that. Just shut up and listen. Hmm. Whoa. This is literally the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my life. And that means I need to get outside more. So yeah, you can see the parts that I'm using. That little pooky, pooky thing coming out of the um, uh, the circle thing. Uh, that's like a little crew habitat that extends, and that's a cool little experimental part. And then I've got some spotlights on the front here too, so that, you know, if I want to like go look at something, it'll be, you know, look lookable. Is that a word? I don't know. And you can see the, the weird lights that are coming out. They're called docking lights, and I guess that's that was part of the same mod. And uh, I guess it just makes it a little bit easier to, to dock if you line them up with the ports um, when you're coming in. I mean, I really use the... Oh, look at that. I can't... Sorry, I have to stop and stare at this. Beautiful, beautiful... Look at this. It's like, this is... This is a game where, like, your accomplishment is not, like, getting an achievement or, like, getting, like, through the level or whatever. It's just, like, you built that and then you got that in orbit and and it's it's there. Yeah, unfortunately, uh, we've completely exhausted all our fuel getting into orbit. So, uh, yeah, so, I don't know. Uh, tune in next time and maybe I'll show you some space docking. And by that I don't mean to penises enveloping one another or maybe i do i don't know anyway bye